Good evening and welcome to the Thai PBS World. We now live in the age of so-called the age of disruption. Social and technological change are quite fast. The question must be on education institution, especially the university level, what it can offer, the new skill for the new generation. I asked two students who decide to take their course in innovation school, the new course from Jilalongkorn University. What can university offer in this age of digital disruption in which changes are happening real fast? We are told what are taught today can be obsolete tomorrow because new technologies are spreading seemingly overnight like cell phones and social media. And then AI, genetic engineering and robotics are coming up. Chulalongkorn University has initiated a new school of arts and science in integrated innovation or BASAI since last year. The innovation school aims at producing students to be ready for business entrepreneurship, technology and innovation with lifelong learning and 21st century skills. Bemika Jomsiri Watana, first year of BASAI student, is from a family business background Though in first year, she has got an idea of her startup. I asked her why she made a decision to take a venture in this school. What brings you to be a student here at Innovation School? Yes, first of all, I think that the Innovation School, this Basai School, uh, makes the benefits from the... They, they have a playground for the students. Yes, and my family and me are interested that they have it and they uh, have like uh, many fields of uh, subjects here. What have you learned from the course? Yeah, for this first year, we learned about the business and entrepreneurship, accounting, financing. Yeah, and uh, the next semester, we will learn about the technologies. Why? Why do you think it's good for, for the present and the future? Yes, because nowadays, it's hard to live in this world without when you know just only one field, right? Because how disrupt of the engineering come across to the business side? Because we learn the bachelor degree in engineering and the master degree you will learn about the MBA. It's disrupt the business side very much, but this could give us in just uh, one degree in the bachelor degree. So it will be the opportunity for the student very much. And what's the project that you are developing? Yes, I'm focusing on the food waste. Uh, I cooperate with my friends there here, like six people, about the out of shelf life. I, I, I will not mention about the expired food because it's still not expired, but it's just an out of shelf life, out of shelf life date food in the supermarket. So I bring that product to sell to the consumer that, uh, that doesn't have the many budget to buy them, but they still want to eat them. And how does the environment of studying here stimulate you to think for the future or think more? And do you think it's different from being student in other faculties? Yes, as I, as I mentioned before about the playground that Basai gave us, the teacher here is like Sometimes they be just like the mentor for us, that they will guide us to be the good path and the friends from here. They have a great background. They know what they want to do. They, they all have a passion on the startups. So it brings every student here to, be, to grow up. And what, what do you think the, the faculty or the school can help you to thrive for your future? Yes, because they started soon. Uh, I started very fast because they started from the one one year student. So I think that if I uh, graduate from this school, I know that I have one startup already. So it means that I am faster than other students from other faculty. What do you think is the skill that you get from studying here, in which in other department may not provide you? Maybe the soft skill, the communication skill, because we have a lot of uh, international students, the, the Chinese, the Japanese. 
that uh, we talk in English very much than other faculties. But this is school of innovation. So where does innovation come from? I think every student have the innovation inside, but they don't know how to bring it out. So the teacher here know how to bring it. And it's come to be true. Another student, Atishai Watana Paison, a Taiwanese born in Thailand, who graduated from an international school, said that international environment at the innovation school is crucial for him to study here. This environment can help generate the sense of global citizenship for him. Why? It has to be Basai mm. because it's your first degree and your first batch of student here. Why yeah. Basai? So the reason I picked Basai was because, um, uh, well, long story short, um, I decided that maybe going abroad is not good, that good, good, good of an option because I think eventually I'm going to come back home anyways. I'm going to come back to Thailand. And I've seen people who go abroad and they come back and they don't understand the culture, they don't understand you know, the business, the economy here and they can't really survive and they can't really thrive that well. So I decided that you know, staying in Thailand is a, is a necessity. And Basai is one of the few programs, actually maybe the only program in, in uh, Thailand in Bangkok region that offers a very international-based learning. It's almost as if I can study in Thailand and feel like I'm getting an education from abroad. It's kind of a combination of everything you know, I wanted. What have you learned so far, so far? from Basai? So right now, uh, we're just doing more uh, business-oriented things. So more um, entrepreneurship, a lot of a lot of planning, a lot of idea generation, a lot of uh, figuring out solutions. Uh, so yeah, I think those would be the three big things: like um, planning and uh, idea generation, and like uh, figuring out solutions. That'd be the three things if I if I had to. And you must have got your idea already about your project, what uh, you'd like to do. So, so for the project, yeah, right now, um, we're still kind of developing the idea. We're, we're always open to, like, we're always taught and we're always willing to open our minds to new ideas. So we're just, you know, going along. But when new ideas or better ideas, you know, come, arise and come up, we'll definitely make adjustments. But yeah. We're, we're having a steady pace in that aspect. In this day and age, we talk a lot about technological mm. disruption yeah. and how the new generation has to have new skills mm. to cope with changes like AI, automation, and industrial revolution. What do you think the course or knowledge from Basai can help you? Mm. I think an important aspect of, of Basai is, is teaching kind of the methods, right? Um, like there's, there's so many fields nowadays, it's really impossible to cover all of them in the span of four years. I don't, I don't believe that's, that's possible. But you know, I, I do believe that Basai has the potential to allow us the resources, um, allow us the, the platform to seek out the knowledge. Uh, I want to tell a, bit, a, a short little story. So actually, uh, this weekend, I went um, and attend and help out um, GID, a program with um, Imperial College from London. So I believe, I, I hope I'm not wrong, because <laughs> that'd be funny. But um, the, you know, we had uh, visitors, master students from GID come over to Thailand. So we went around uh, with them. We also did classes and projects with them. And something they really, they, they really talked about and I uh, really experienced was you know, the ability to to meet new people, to internationally develop and to learn new things because I believe it's, it's very narrow-minded if we expect to learn everything from one single school and from one single country. And you know, the experience with GID, I've made new friends and it's also opened my eyes to a lot of new information that other people have, you know, ideas that other people have that are culturally different, that are um, ethnic, ethnic, ethnically different and you know, that grew up very differently, their ideas can can have a big impact, you know, on us because we're we're so different. We can learn a lot from them, and they too can learn a lot from us. As global challenges are transforming fast, human skills and human resources with innovative minds must be ready for the age of disruption, which is happening right now. <laughs>